heck is a passive ability? Like, what the heck does Heavy Hitter do? Or what the heck does a uh, Stamina Penalty Down do? Well, stay tuned and I'll teach you what they mean. Hey yo, fellow attackers, it's me, Captain Jack Attack! Welcome back, and if you're new, welcome to the party! Today I'll be going over some helpful information on what these little abilities do on your parts and how they can help improve your gameplay in Roblox Super Striker League. First of all, what are these abilities anyways? Well, they're known as passive abilities and they are certain perks that you can get from uncreating good quality parts or by upgrading them with cash. There are 60 known passive abilities in Super Striker League at the moment and we'll go through each and every one in detail so you know exactly what they do and how they can improve your gameplay and skill. Before we start, I'd like to say a big thank you to Cindering for sending me the ability icons that were used in this video. It will help to identify them easier. Also, the perks of the same type will Every end up night. stacking up. But it is noted that each duplicate perk will have a diminished effect applied to it. You'll still be seeing an increase in the perk, but it won't be as strong as the first when applied. Alright, let's see the list. The first passive skill we'll be going over is the Sprint Stamina Saver. This ability reduces the stamina used when you are running, and you'll be able to sprint over a larger area. This will make it easier to outlast your sprinting in order to catch up on defense or to get an edge on offense. Next we have the Sprint Speed Up. The ability does as it says, it merely increases your sprint speed. You can use this ability in order to catch up quicker on both sides of the field. The third ability is the Fast Stamina Regen Passive ability. This ability increases how quickly your stamina regenerates. This will allow you to sprint quicker in between the cooling times. This can help a ton, especially when you need the meter to charge quicker for a much needed dodge or deke move. Fourthly, we have the Fast Supercharge ability. This will cause the super meter on below the screen to charge at a faster rate over time. That's right, you can do more frequent super strikes with this one, so it could be a game changer. Next we have the Shot Damage Boost ability. This one increases the damage dealt by regular shots with the soccer ball. So you know how when you shoot at a goalie, his stamina gets reduced? Well this ability causes the goalie to lose even more stamina whenever you shoot at him. A goalie with less stamina will make it harder for him to make saves, which will dramatically increase your chances of scoring. In 6th we have the Power Up Damage Boost. This increases the effectiveness of power-ups by knocking down players longer and also does more damage to the goalie. Who doesn't like knocking down other players for a longer time anyways, right? Gives you more time to make a play if you can nail them just right. Seventh passive ability is the heavy hitter. This one allows you to stun players for a longer time when you hit them with a tackle. Feels good to take them down, doesn't it? As they are down longer, it can help you out on your breakaways, improving your defense as well as your offensive opportunities. Up next is the Curve Ball Boost. This ability would give you an increased possible curve when shooting the ball. Now this translates to being able to perform a more effective curve shot. And we all know how hard it is to defend those insane curve shots, right? Halfway there! Up next we have the Rebound Speed Boost. This will grant you a speed boost after taking a shot on goal. Now this can help you gather a second or even a third chance shot if you miss your first one. So this ability helps tremendously on offense. The tenth ability is the Steal Speed Boost. This ability will increase your speed boost when you steal the ball. Again, this will help you with your breakaways, especially when stealing the ball from the enemy team. It's useful for both offense and defense. The next ability is a Super Duration Up. This ability does as it says, it increases your super boost length a bit. Very useful for both offense and defense as you can utilize its speed boost longer and have some more time for a potential super strike. 
12th ability is the skill shot power boost. This will grant you an increased power and damage output dealt by skill shots. What's a skill shot you may ask? It's a fully powered shot when you charge up your kick to the max and release. This ability will spice and up your kicks. What's 13, eh? Well, it's the Super Strike Power Boost. This will increase your power and damage dealt by Super Strikes if they didn't even seem menacing enough. This sounds like if you stack a bunch of these together, the whole arena could crumble down, so try your own risk. The next one is the Stamina Penalty Down ability. This will decrease your penalty for repeatedly using defensive moves. If you tackle a lot in a row, you start to notice that you tackle slower and slower. Well, this ability will counteract with that feature so you can do tackles more efficiently in between each other. This can help your defense quite a bit. Two more to go! This next one is Fast Pass Charging. It does what it says. Your passes will charge up in power quicker, which means that you don't have to hold onto the ball as long if you want to pass it pretty far. This saves a lot of time, which means more time to score. And for our last ability, we have the Super Stun Reduction. It's a cool ability that decreases your stun time while your super boost is active. This way, if you get tackled with the boost enabled, you can quickly get back up on your feet and try a counterattack to grab that ball back. There you have it! All 16 of Roblox Super Striker League's passive abilities explained and how they can help you on the field. If this helped you out, be sure to like, comment, and don't forget to smash that subscribe button to stay up to date to my videos. Stay safe and I'll see you all next time.